Hi guys, how's it going? I am the Conflict Nerd. Hello and welcome back to SimCity. Welcome back to Tamarin Island. We have an abandoned building. There we go. Too much crime. Deal with it. Not my problem. So last time, we managed to get gambling going quite nicely. We're making a lot of profit off of gambling, which is uh, something I never necessarily thought I would say, but, well, I'm happy to say it. Because it's good money. I mean, seriously, seriously good money. So I think today, what I want to aim for is getting the Roman Luck Casino, which I can currently afford. You know, I, I can afford it right now, but the thing is, that will leave me around 20, by the time I place it, around 25,000 simoleons, which I don't know that I'd be comfortable with if I'm honest, and the reason I don't know that I'd be comfortable with it is simply because I... Basically, I, I worry that it might cost a lot at first to get off the ground, because, I mean, this costs three and a half thousand simoleons per hour. So I'm not sure. I also don't know where I'd place it, is the other concern. And it could probably go right there, I suppose, or along here, maybe. And that seems like a relatively good spot. Then again, we do have the coast. That'd be a bit of a problem. Down here could work. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. I'm really not sure where to place this. It could go on the coast there, but that's going to get rid of some nice buildings, and I really like how that looks. So... I might just stick it over here. That could work. I suppose. Just off the avenue here. Or stick it on an avenue. I can just put it up here. I mean, I know I can do that. You know, I, I might just do that. No, I want somewhere with a lot of room. I'm going to put it here. There we go. We'll stick it right there. That's costing us a lot, but hopefully we'll be okay. Hopefully that'll open up fairly soon. Let's see what upgrades we can get here. So we've got the sign, which I want to stick just there. We have the Roman rooms, which are medium wealth, and then the Roman rooms, which are also medium, then the penthouse, which is high wealth. We can't get this, because we need the gaming division. And the concert hall, we also can't get. So we need the gaming division to get more high wealth gamblers in here. Which is interesting. Certainly interesting. Let's get some... So we can get six. So if I went one, two... So two of these, and then two penthouses, then I can leave myself room to get both of these sometime. So we'll do that. So one, two, and then I want two penthouses on top of that, even though the penthouses can go there. Yeah, two penthouses there, and then we can get those at a later date. So we'll just have to save up for that. I mean, this is currently hiring, which is kind of the, uh, the problem here. It's hiring, so it's losing a lot of money. Hopefully... Hopefully that'll open soon, because I really don't want to be losing buttloads of money, like we are currently doing. So yeah, if that could go ahead and hurry up and open, that would be fantastic news. It'll open eventually. It'll open fairly soon. Oh man, we really are turning into quite the little gambling den around here, aren't we? I mean, everything seems to be revolving around gam- what the hell? Casino closed. Is it more residential to get workers? Oh boy. That's bad. This is currently working. It'll pay out something. Do we not have people to work here at all? Really? There's no one wanting to work there? Oh, no, there it goes. Now it's open. I wonder if it'll make that money back, though. That's the thing. I'm really not sure about this. This, this might have been a bad move. Might have been. We might be okay. We might be able to pull it back. We'll see what happens. This is... Oh, yeah, that's going ahead. Good. At least the expo center is sort of working. We are having some problems with sewage, apparently. There are backed up pipes. Oh, dear. I don't have the money to sort that. Huh. That's going to be awkward. We're going to have to leave that a little bit. And just let the crap sit in the streets for a while. Because there's really nothing I can do. This is not really making as much money as I would have liked. Which is kind of annoying. Hopefully, we'll see some high wealth people come to it eventually. Hopefully, we'll... Oh, it's losing so much. It's losing so much. It's making so little. 
I really hope that picks up a bit. It is, it is slowly picking up, but I, I hope it picks up more. Because I really need the money. Also, how's this doing? Pretty good. That's going to have a good payout. This is also making lots of money. And this is also making lots of money. How's this doing? Come on. Start making me buttloads. Just make me buttloads of money. That's all I need. Just all the money in the world. Also, interesting to point out that sewage now seems to be okay-ish. It's not perfect, but I mean, it's not on a minus anymore. Oh, never mind. Never mind. There's a lot of crap coming out of the expo center that we just need to uh, deal with. Fortunately, once that show's over, we can make... We can, we can make the necessary upgrades over here and probably go ahead and upgrade this as well. Which still isn't isn't really making us the money that I'd like. Although I think that's because we can't get any high wealth lodgers. I'd like to get some of those on the go. So another couple of hours and we'll be able to get the expo center payout and go from there. Also, is that abandoned? That is abandoned. Why are you abandoned? Freight shipments and freight shipments. Interesting. Okay. That's a bit strange, but whatever. I suppose that's the way things go from time to time. You are making me so little. You're losing 40,000 a day in profits. Oh, that's depressing. That is that is depressing. Now, can this show hurry up and end so I can have the money? There we go. All right. Let's go ahead and get the penthouses. So we'll stick that there and stick that there. It's costing us even more per day, but that'll hopefully help with the uh, lodging issue. We need the gaming division. Can I upgrade this? Can I get a gaming division? I can. I Well, I can't afford it, but I can get one eventually. Which I suppose I should probably do at some point. We'll put the HQ sign just there. Okay, we're going to have to get that gaming division sometime soon. Sometime very soon. I could take out a couple of bonds to do it, but I don't think I've got the money to, uh, I don't think I have the income to balance the, uh, extra expense, so I don't think we'll bother with that just yet. This, this still isn't making me enough. We are still losing lots of money every day, and that really, really isn't good enough. That needs to be sorted. Also, let's just pop over here for a sec. Not the coal place. Give me this. We need to deal with sewage, and we need to do it now, so let's do that. Okay, and you know what? I'm going to slap another one of those on there just to uh, make sure we don't have to deal with it again anytime soon. Maybe another one? Maybe? No, we don't need it. We don't need it right now. Also, we're making money. Where the hell did that come from? I mean, this still isn't making me enough. But somehow we're making a lot of money anyway. It's very strange. That is very strange. Also, some upgrades going on here, which is nice to see. Okay, I can approve of this. I can get behind this. We're just not getting enough tourists. That's the problem here. That That is the major issue. Oh, wait, there isn't a... Let's try putting a bus stop just there. And there. Alright, sewage is fine. This isn't. And it is suggesting that I start building mega tires. I suppose I could do that. It'll cause a lot more traffic, but I mean, I don't see why not. I mean, how much are they? 120,000 for a mega tire with an apartment level? Hmm. Well, what do we need? It is just residential is the issue, and it is suggesting I build a mega tire to deal with it, so I mean... I don't see why not. I just need a good spot for us. Well, there kind of works. Anywhere along here I could put one? I mean, I, I guess there works. We, just, we don't really have that much room around here. This place wasn't designed with mega towers in mind. I, mean, I could totally go and stick one down here, but it's not exactly high wealth, is it? So yeah, over there could work. I guess. I don't see why not. Not the most pleasant place, and I've realized it is right beside an airport, and it is a giant building, but sure. Sure, that'll that'll work. We'll stick it over there when we have the money. How's this going? It is making money. Just not enough. I mean, it's, it's climbing. Very slowly. Very slowly. Painfully slowly. But, you know, it's, it's climbing nonetheless. Let's take out some bonds. I'm going to need to... 
I need to get the money. I want to get that extra gambling house. So there we go. We've taken out a couple of bonds. If I can get the money for the extra gambling houses, that'd be great. I should probably also go ahead and schedule another event so I can just get some more money coming in here. All right. To hell with it. I'm going to take out another bond just so I can go ahead and get the gaming thing because I want to start attracting more people. So a gaming division can go over here, maybe? Can I put it over here? Uh, I could stick it there, but I don't want to. Sure, stick it there. There we go. That's unlocked a couple of things, meaning I can go ahead over to here and get more of the, uh, the high wealth people coming in and gambling. Which is exactly what I want. So let's do that. We'll stick the uh, thing just there. Alright, that should do the job. That might bring in more high wealth gamblers. I suppose it does accommodate more high wealth gamblers. But will it attract them, is the question. Also, I've just noticed we are making a decent little bit off these medium wealth tourists. So if we could get more of those, that'd be great. That, that would be pretty great if we could get more of the medium wealth guys, because... I mean, we're getting there. We are slowly approaching a point where we might be making a profit off of this, so... That, that would be lovely. I think I have encountered our problem, though. I think I have worked out what's going on. I, I'm, I'm thinking that the issue is that we're just not attracting enough high-wealth tourists. There is nothing that is necessarily... Necessarily attractive to someone who has a great deal of wealth. This is what I'm thinking. So I kind of need something that is attractive to people with high wealth. I've just noticed that we're actually losing money, and I really want to know where that's all going. Why Why aren't we making that much money right now? That's, that's kind of an issue that needs to be fixed fairly quickly, because we're losing a lot. And it's just gone up again, slightly. Is this just the whole thing with casinos losing money in the early hours of the day and then making it all back later on? Is that what's going on here? Because this is slowly getting there. I mean, there are more high wealth people in here. We're slowly approaching a profit on this casino. This one is already making a lot of money. I'm really not sure where all that money's going. What the hell's going on there? Let's just very quickly tear you down. I want to have another look at gambling here. So... Yeah, it seems that the city specialization is... is fluctuating. That seems to be what's going on. Sometimes it makes more, sometimes it makes less. Sometimes it costs less, and sometimes it costs more. It probably doesn't help this is... yet to make a profit. So I think I might have to go ahead and turn this off. I might have to do it. Because it's just... Well, actually, hold on. That is... That is slowly climbing. It is approaching a bit of a profit. I'm going to leave that on. I'm going to... I am going to leave that on because I think we might be able to do this. If we're clever. I mean, if worse comes to worse, I can go ahead and turn the police station off again. And I can turn this off. I just don't really want to because it is... We are getting more high wealth people in here. It's just taking a bit of time. What's this? Someone's robbing the place. Great. Just what we need. Oh, we're making money again. All right, then. That's very strange. This is... Yeah, this is getting there. It'll take a little bit of time, but it's it's getting there. This is... Oh, I've realized that that might have actually pulled our total profit down for casinos. Yeah, that, that might have uh, cost us a bit in profit. Can I look at the... Uh... So that's mid. There are hotels. Mid and not very many high. That is a bit of everything, actually. Some hotels. That is not a bit of everything. That... Oh, it's interesting that I can see who's attracted to this. So that's very, very much medium wealth. I suppose that, the, the Globe Theatre might be high wealth. How much does it cost? A 
thousand. But I don't know. I, I want to keep that off for a little bit, just until we can afford it some more. Sydney Opera House would probably also attract high wealth people, I imagine. So that might be something to look into as well. Making enough enough money so we can have the Globe Theatre and Sydney Opera House open at the same time. That'd be nice. What's the issue here? What's wrong? Sickness. Oh dear. Oh dear. How's this going? We're currently trading. There's no deaths, but we're trading 17 out of 28 injured people per day and 10 out of 16 sick people. Well, we do have a hospital. We do have a clinic as well. So I don't know what's wrong. How's this going? Still no profit. Still no profit, but... I mean, we're getting there. We are so close to making a profit. And no, we're not. It's gone back down. And it's gone back up. Nope. It's so close. That is... That is painful to watch. It gets so close to making a profit. So I've come to the conclusion that we just need an entertainment division. This concert hall will attract high wealth tourists, and that's pretty much what we really need. So, we basically just need to be making a lot more profit off of gambling every day. And we also need to be making loads off of events and stuff like that. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to turn this off. And that's going to make us lots of money every day. Or every hour. No, it's not. What the hell? That that was making us an extra 7,000. I suppose that's a lot of income gone as well, isn't it? Oh, look, it's the shard. Interesting. That's the act. That's pretty much the actual shard. Fair enough. All right. So let's get back to my thinking process here. If we keep that turned off for a bit, I can probably afford to open another one of these. And make more money off of another one of these, as opposed to something that doesn't bring in any low wealth at all. So, I'm going to do that. Or I'm going to try and do that. I just need somewhere good to put it. Now, I could probably stick it over here or somewhere. Actually, I want to try just that. Let's get rid of the little gambling house. Alright. And then let's go ahead and stick another sleek casino in here. Now, I can't do it there because of the pathway, but we could easily get rid of that. So, if we go ahead and do that. Alright. And then what we want to do is go ahead and start putting stuff on here that's going to bring in more gamblers. So, we want both of these, which can go around here somewhere, I'm sure. I suppose it could go there, couldn't it? Oh, this is going to be interesting, actually, because this is making things a little bit complicated. So, if we put a sign there, go ahead and bring in more... I don't know if I want... I want to try bringing in medium wealth gamblers, I think. So, let's get some medium wealth in here. And then let's get some... And we already have lodging, don't we? No, we don't, actually. Right. So that's low wealth, that is medium wealth, and that is high wealth. We currently have some low wealth, but I'm going to go... I mean, these I can afford, so I suppose it wouldn't hurt if I did that, followed by that, followed by a penthouse, followed by some more... I, I really want to place a craps parlor, is my thought here. I should probably get rid of the mayor's house from there. That would help. So if we go ahead and do that. We can get the craps parlor that I want. I think. Yeah, there we go. Oh, no, no. I want the, the poker parlor. That's what I wanted. All right. And then some sleek rooms. Like so. Oh, no. Wait. No. Bugger. That's not what I wanted at all. Uh, I wanted... Oh, the hell. That'll do. That'll do. That'll hopefully bring in some money once it starts working. At least I bloody hope it does. If it could start working, that would kind of be fab. Just saying. Just saying. We could really do with this working sometime soon to start bringing in the money. You know, that thing that we really need. Money. Please. 
We are dangerously close to losing everything here. This is up and running, which is great. But we need more, is the thing. We need more people in here spending their money. Otherwise... Oh, hold on. We are on the edge. We are on the edge here. We might be okay. I think... I think we might be okay. We're sort of pulling it back here. We can get a lot of... We can get a lot of tourists in here spending their money, so we might be okay. I think... I think we might have done it here, so... Oh, wait, no, the money... Oh, it's so dangerously close. We are seriously close to losing everything. I know I could go turn off the police station, but I don't want to have to do that. I really don't want to have to do that. Because the aim of the game here is to be making enough money so that we can turn this back on. I mean, that's the point. We need to make the money to turn that casino back on, so... Oh, holy crap. We just got a lot of people in here. Yeah, we're making money again. Good. We are making lots of money again. And this has still got a lot of people that can come in here and start spending, so... Yeah, I'm gonna take that. That's that's a lot of money that we're making very suddenly. I just worry that that's probably gonna disappear at some point soon. Now, one thing I've done that I didn't quite realize is I didn't schedule an event, so I'm just gonna schedule some motocross for tomorrow and give this place a break for a night. So that that might actually be okay. This is making this is making a lot of those medium wealth tourists. Holy crap, that's nice to see. That is really, really nice to see. Okay, we're ma we're gonna make some good money off of that. I feel like I could probably open this again, but I don't want to do it just yet. I want to have some money in the bank just sitting there, so that when I do open this, we can sit and lose a little bit of money while this gets people working and while it. Oh, they want schools, or they move out. Oh dear, that's uh. They miss going to school, don't like the high taxes, they demand education, they miss going to school. Okay, they want schools, fine, fine, fine. We can afford a grade school. We could, uh, we could easily afford a grade school, I suppose. Which could go right there, but that's not gonna really help many people, so, uh... Yeah, to hell with it, we'll stick a grade school just... There, I suppose. Alright. A university could attract students from across the whole region. Well, we're not getting a university because we don't bloody need it. Well, how many students do we have? That's the question. How many people want to go to school? A lot! That grade school is going to be useless. That grade school is going to be absolutely useless. But I suppose it'll do for now. Can we make... Can we nearly make 10,000 off of this? I mean, we're getting there. I suppose if it was full, we'd probably be making about 10,000, yeah. That would be nice. That would be very nice. Let's go ahead and start upgrading the school. I suppose we're going to need more classrooms, aren't we? So stick those ones there. We'll go ahead and get another set of buses. Going to need a flag out the front. And a sign just there. Also going to need school bus stops, aren't we? Which are 200 each. So we'll see if we can get some decent coverage for as cheap as possible. There we go. These guys don't really need the bus stops, but sure, they can have them. Uh, you guys down here as well. You guys over here. There's a lot of places in need of bus stops. All you guys along there as well. Up here. Oh, God. The whole bloody place needs school bus stops, apparently. That seems like reasonable coverage. Alright, that'll do the job. That'll hopefully bring in a lot of students. And by a lot of students, I mean 350. Not feeling confident about that school, honestly. I have, I have a feeling that we're going to need to upgrade very soon. What's wrong with the shard? Not enough ship, uh, freight shipments. What the hell's up with freight then? Why why is this is this just not working? Does it need more trucks or something? It could probably do with some more, I suppose. We'll work on that eventually. We'll work on that later. How's this going? 
This is making... It's losing 3,000 per day, apparently. Interesting. It's also not making as much right now as it could be. That's a bit annoying. It would be kind of nice to see the money go back up and see it making more money. I'm kind of curious as to where the hell everyone went. Oh. We can't seem to house everyone there, actually. At least the money's gone back up. Okay. Right. I... I'm not entirely sure about this. On one hand, I feel like we could open this. On the other, I'm just not certain. At all. I mean, I, I'm, I'm really not. So I think what I might do is leave it there for this episode. But I'm going to leave the game running. And I'm going to keep playing. I'm not really going to change anything. I'm just going to make sure that the city doesn't go bankrupt. I'm going to make and gather as much money as I possibly can from the gambling. So that we can go ahead and open this again. Because I feel like that's something we should probably be aiming for. I mean, this is now making a profit, which is fantastic. This is always making a profit. This has actually earned a lot more today than it did yesterday, which is inter or than this one is. Interesting. But yeah, they're all making a profit. This one is also making a profit. So I'm hoping that they can come together and make enough profit to get us the upgrade that we need to this to go ahead and get the entertainment division. Because when we get that, we can get the concert hall, which will attract those high wealth tourists that we really need. So that's my thought process. And that's why I'm going to just leave the game running. I'm going to make some money. And then we'll come back next time and hopefully be able to open this Roman Luck Casino. So with that in mind, folks, thank you very much for watching. I've been the Conflict Nerd and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.